Well, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's 7demo7, and you guys are now looking at my KA8, which was my Christmas present to myself. I picked it up used on RC Groups for 55 bucks, which is a great steal because these are not available anymore. You have to find them used or uh, new used condition. So I did some improvements to it where I covered the wings with laminate, and I also included a uh, front spar, which it's not included in the original kit. So um, you guys will see a couple of my flights here. You're not going to see all of them. I had a couple of really hard landings, but uh, everything came out pretty nice. Um, also, the the onboard footage is from the new Run Cam 2 with a the wider field of view lens, which is 170 degrees. But uh, the first thing that you're going to see here is the air brakes, which I think is the coolest part about this airplane. And I'll talk to you guys soon. These are my air brakes here. And uh, you will note that the right one doesn't come up quite as much as the left one, just by a little bit, but it shouldn't make a big difference here. I don't even know if I'm going to be using the air brakes um, at this point. So, Alright, so I have my CG set at, I believe it's 65 millimeters. I'll put a notation there, but it is just perfectly balanced right there. I always put a little bit of hot glue where my CG is supposed to be, so... Okay, so here's the KA-8. Just a little bit of breeze here. I don't think I'm going to be up for very long, but we shall see. So you give it a nice big toss here. Oh, there's a little bit of lift right there. I'm going to, and it's dying. Oh boy, oh no, up, 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 oh no. After further review of all my flight footage, I'm determining now that I was a little bit tail heavy, so keep that in mind. It's gonna come this way here, so I'm gonna try this one more time. Let me just make sure that my battery pack didn't shift. the rudder and the elevator I've got a bird over there there we go that's looking pretty good I am getting a lot of lift now awesome Whew. that bird is not happy with me being there <laughs> Ooh, boy, sorry, I'm right under the sun here. There we go. Hey. I'm gonna use some very subtle controls here. I think when I use too much control, it might move around a little bit on me here. That's pretty nice. So far, so good. I'm just kind of ruddering it around here, trying to steer with my rudder. A lot of lift today, this is really nice. Get this thing going a little faster here. I'm just a little worried on these turns. You gotta get, keep the speed up here. I think I'm gonna be going down. All right, let's see if I can't. Slowly just bring this bad boy in here. I'm not sure I can actually stay up. Pull. Ugh, ouch. <laughs> Alright, I deployed the uh, brakes but just not on time. Okay, that was a pretty good flight I must say. Let's check all the control surfaces. Always check your control surfaces after your uh, hard landings. Alright, so wind's picking up a little bit, that's a good thing.
Right into the sun. Ruddering over here a little bit. Sorry for the blockage here. Let's try and get some more lift off those trees over there. Lots of lift right there. Yep, it's going up. Yay. I actually bought a variometer for my Tyrannus radio. I have this on the Spectrum right now, but uh, the variometer should be a big help in getting this thing uh, flying. And man, I don't need any help today. I'm definitely in a thermal. Look at that buddy go. Yeah, buddy. I'll put the nose down here so I can get a little bit of speed. So I'm gonna rudder over here, go back above those trees, see if I can catch more lift. Keep, keep the speed up a little bit while the while the wind is behind me. Yeah, not bad here. Nice thing is I, I just have to kind of be hands off on the controls. If you control it too much, sometimes you just create a lot of drag. Says the guy that's not really slope sword that much. <laughs> Hopefully I don't land in the trees, that would be nice. So bring her around here, catch a little bit of speed maybe, put the nose down. Oof, that sun is blinding. Turn this guy around here. Oh, there's a little bit of lift right there. Turn into it. You can always tell when that when what you need to turn into the wing that lifts up. Okay. I think I'm gonna be coming down here. I'm gonna pull my brakes. So guys, I think in that video right now, the KA8 is uh, it's a great plane. I don't think they're actually offered anymore, so uh, you can find one used um, in good condition like I did. Definitely go for it. I could definitely recommend it. I mean, this is a very very light day for lift and man this thing has been, been performing great. I love I love the air brakes. It's just one of the coolest features of this thing. Also the fact that this is my first scale glider. So anyway I'm gonna end the uh, video right now because when I'm flying this thing I need to have my hat protecting my eyes and it's really tough uh, looking into the sun. So talk to you guys later. Bye.